He went to go spend time with God. But see, when he went to go spend time with God, he made sure his family was all right. See, he made sure his family was taken care of and full. He went and had a talk with God. Then Jacob left alone, and a man wrestled with him until the break of day. Now when he saw that he did not prevail against him, he touched the socket of his hip, and the socket of Jacob's hip was out of joint as he wrestled with him. Remember what the topic was. God said something to change. But you gotta wrestle with him first. Jacob got up because he couldn't sleep. Man, man. He went to be alone to talk to the Lord, but it came out and he began to wrestle with him. He wrestled with him for a long time because she didn't say it was nighttime. Don't know the hour, but see, he didn't just pray in other words for this five minutes. He prayed and he probably even fasted for a while until he got his hip out of place. See, when you begin to wrestle with God, when you come up and wrestle with him, something got to change. Your head ought to be hurt for praying so much. Your back ought to be aching for laying out so long. Your feet ought to have a cramp. Uh, something ought to take place when you begin to wrestle with God. But see, one thing about it, even though his hip got knocked out of socket, he could still wrestle. Now when he saw that he did not prevail against him, he touched the sign. When he was wrestling with the angel, the angel knew that he could prevail against Jacob because Jacob was going to turn loose. See, he was afraid that his brother was going to kill him, so he began to wrestle with God a little, a little while longer. It said it was a break of day, huh? Even though my back hurt God, I'm not going to stop praying. Even though I got a headache, Lord, I'm still going to keep praising and worshiping. Even though I'm lost right now, but that ain't going to stop me, y'all. Because see, what I need from you, I, I need you to bless me. I, oh, Jacob begin to tell him, I'm not going to turn you loose. Woo! He began to tell him, and he said, let me go. It's the angel of the Lord talking to Jacob. Let me go. Ah, oh, what did Jacob say? But he said, I will not let you go unless you bless me. So he said to him, what is your name? He said, Jacob. And he said, your name shall no longer be called Jacob, but Israel. For you have struggled with God and with men, and you prevail. Amen. When we begin to have these trials and tribulations, and we begin to pray and fast and lay out before the Lord, we'll get up from there, huh? Because it's uncomfortable. But Jacob knew he wanted God to bless him. He knew he wanted God to change his brother's heart because he was coming to kill him. On the day Jacob wrestled with the Lord, he said, I'm not going to let you go, amen, until you bless me. The Lord is saying on today that the day you're looking for, you got to wrestle for it, amen. Don't turn the Lord loose until he deliver your children. Don't turn the Lord loose until he deliver your husband. Don't turn the Lord loose until he deliver your wife. Amen. Don't turn the Lord loose until he get you your blessing. But he will give up. Because our body get that age. Amen. Not only did he bless Jacob, but he changed his name. Amen. After you wrestle with God, he said something has to change. What it is that need to be changed in your life? What is it that need to be changed in your life? Amen. If you say something to be ready to change, after you don't wrestle with God, something to change.
what you get done right to your address than the church. What you get done wrestling, your attitude gonna change. What you get done wrestling with God, you won't be barren no more than. What you wrestle with God, he'll turn your morning into dancing. What you wrestle with God, huh? that sick body will be healed in. What you wrestle with God, your lifestyle will change your man. What you wrestle, see, we got to wrestle with him. I'm not just saying praying just one time. Huh? See, we got to pray to a hurt in there. But I'm still reminding the Bible that said that Jacob Hill was not out of place. Huh? It was not out of place because the angel wanted to let him go. We got to grab God so top level. The way we ain't gonna let you go until I see some manifestation. I'm praying for my family. I'm praying for my husband. I'm praying for my wife. I'm not gonna let you go until you bless me. Ah. Ooh. 